All right, people, welcome back. Today, I want to try out the boy Red Slater, or Red Slater, Blue Slater, sorry. Uh, obviously, day one SSR unit. Very, very, very odd, but I was surprised to see his substats for a day one unit aren't too bad, man. 70% pierce rate, really good. 65% resistance, pretty damn good. 50% uh, crit chance is, you know, okay. It's fine because he does have a card that triples his crit chance, so that's perfectly okay. Uh, and really, really nice crit damage at 198% after Super Awakening. That is a very, very good percent of uh, crit damage. Only bad thing is this crit resistance is garbage, 12%. It's, just, it's like Lost Veins, and the crit defense is terrible as well, 41%. If we was to face an enemy Ludo, this Slater would basically have no protection against crits. And uh, to top it off, the lifesteal was absolutely garbage. But he does have a debuff card, and he has a guaranteed crit card. So, uh, you know, thought I would take him on a spin in the, the Hell's Kitchen debuff sync, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Goth, Ludo, the usual, and uh, Demon Hendrickson. Of course, we are going to be able to rely on Goth for some good damage, just because Demon Hendrickson is such an amazing subunit. CC kind of sucks, but we are Champion 3 heading into Champion 2, so hopefully it's not too bad in terms of going first and second. Let's see how we do. Alright, first game we're going to get... Uh... Oh, wow. Someone who's running Demon Hendrickson in front. Okay, okay. Uh, we have to move quick because <laughs> two turns in, my entire team could be basically dead. Because uh, uh, Demon Hendy, the, his passive is so strong, man. So strong. And 41.5 on a level 2 there. I don't know how I feel about that. 44.8 on the debuff. Missed a few crits. That's that's not bad, actually. That's not bad. That's 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 good. That's good. That's good. Uh, it's better to leave Liz very low HP than to just, uh, you know, take off revive and make her revive back to half HP. So I can't complain about that too much. That's no, that's not too bad. Obviously, we do have Sario Grace on my boy just to ignore any extra crit defense the opponent might have. Uh, obviously, ignore it by an extra 50%. Or well, not 50, but it's like 50% of their current, um, you know, crit defense. He's going to stun my Gothar. All right, mate. I don't blame you for that. Um, surely, Ludo, can you kill her, please? All right, he doesn't, but it's fine. We finish off with him. Uh, we should be able to get his ultimate safe and sound. Uh, nothing the opponent can do. Who does he have in sub? He has Green Escanor. Ay ay ay. Mm. Now this is a really bad matchup. We have two blues. Ah oh, dear god. Yeah, them debuffs are gonna hurt man. Ah oh, look at the way he just chowed my team, man. Uh, we have to go for his Gotha. I can't I can't take an AoE attack, I'll die. I cannot take an AoE. Man, he really level 3 stunned my Gotha. I didn't even see that. Uh, hopefully we get the kill here. Slater doesn't crit, but it's okay, I guess. Uh, but now he's going to start drawing Escanor cards. Yeah, we're, we're, we're dead. Ooh, fat crit there. But Hendrickson has like 50% lifesteal or something ridiculous. Yeah, we're, we're going to lose this, man. Hendrickson is just such a dirty unit, man. He's so powerful, dude. Hendrickson is so 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 powerful man it's really scary look he had like what, what he just he had one turn to hit me with cards bro and look at my team he just one turn just one turn and my team looks like a mess oh wait he got cocky yeah it doesn't really matter though I said he got cocky and then I realized that uh, it doesn't really matter anyway because I can't kill him. Slater would have to do something insane to kill him, which Slater is probably not going to be able to do. Oh, the crits, the crits, the crits. Oh, please don't, please debuffs, please don't kill me. Oh my god, the debuffs, man, the debuffs, they're just too strong, dude. 
Eskino merges ultimate must be nice. Hey, we take the L there, boys. The debuffs are just way they're, they're just too powerful, man. They're, they're too strong. <laughs> Look at his demon, Hendrickson, man. What a demon. What an actual demon. Unfortunate. Slater did okay. Didn't do too bad. But yeah, in terms of like the matchup, we were just kind of outmatched, man. Kind of outmatched. Uh, but it's fine, though. Let's move on. All right, next game. Hopefully not another Demon Hendrickson to haunt me in my nightmares. Uh, we do get the one Eskinor. And we get a red Gotha. Mm. I'm going to get a free... Wait. 86k, yeah, we should be able to, to get a free kill on Gotha. We'll take off Revive from him. Right. Yes, we do. 90.7. And then we'll just chip away a little bit of Eskinor's HP. Mm, 44 rank 2. Uh, did get some nice crits in there. Uh, good draw, good draw, okay. If he attacks seals me, I'm going to go for a Gotha play. But it seems like he's not going to attack seal me. Wow. Alright, we'll be able to kill his Eskinor. Alright, maybe not. Alright, we survived. Wait, what's what's even going on? Please, Ludo, don't get crit. Don't get crit. Oh, even, with the, even without a crit, it killed him? Alright, now we're in a tough spot. Or are we? Let's do this. Let's do it. I just have to go all AoEs. Just try and maximize my damage. Uh, with the loss of uh, Ludo's passive, Gotha doesn't hit as hard, but he's still going to hit respectively, respectably hard, I should say. That's not that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Um, I assume he's going to go for a stun on my Gotha. Did he top deck a stun? Wow. Top deck to stun. Must be nice, bro. Attack seal. Shield. Hey, must be nice, man. Um, is Eskimo gets full passive next turn? Uh, we're being shafted, man. We are being shafted. Kind of a waste to use those skills, but whatever. Alright, we get the Slater cards in. Although I fear it's too late. Wow, just list cards all over the place. Nice. Didn't even rank up Liz, just get stuns. Oh, doubles? Of what? You're telling me you didn't rank up your Liz once? And you just stunned me three times in two turns. In two turns, you stunned me three times without ever ranking up your Liz. Must be nice. Must be nice. Wait. Let me just get Demon Hendy's ultimate real quick. Yeah, must be nice, man. Yep, so close, but yet so far. Level 3 buff, buff that attack a little bit more and then go for the ultimate. Hopefully he crits and kills Eskinor, he'll kill Liz. Ooh. Yeah boys, yeah. There we go, there's your retribution buddy. There is your retribution, how you like that? How you like that my friend? Now it's just a <laughs> red gotha. <laughs> A red Gotha who has a tax seal, but guess what? None of my units have a, have a attack cards. That's funny, man. Oh, how the tables turn. All right, let's kill this uh, Lost Vein Meliodas here. This is a nice little uh, Demon Hendy uh, Green Gotha clutch. We could have easily lost that game. My opponent had disgusting RNG, but... Ooh, 243k crit. Filth. Uh, yeah, we're going to win this one, boys. We're going we're, we're gonna to win this one. Very pleasantly, I might add. I'm going to treasure this. Look at him. He just keeps attack sealing me. For what, man? <laughs> he keeps attack sealing me. Alright. Um, I think it's safe to move on to the next one now. Uh, there's no need to, for you guys to watch me just uh, torture this dude. Let's go to the next game. Next up. 
Ooh, that's... That's quite a few toys for my Slater to play with. I like it, I like it. Who do we want to go for? We have to, we have to go for Kyo. I don't want to deal with this guy's BS. Also, I don't get why you would even run this. You are basically asking to lose against the meta. <laughs> Double red units, man. <laughs> Alright, we destroy red units. That's good to know. That's good to know. Uh, out comes uh, Liz. Death Pierce? Damn, bro. What is this man thinking? Sorry, yo. Kyo. Death Pierce sub. No Liz. Oh, that is a yikes, man. Zero out of ten team would not recommend. I don't know who he's trying to counter, but <laughs> yeah. Obviously, Gotha does get shred, but it's fine. We should be able to kill Sario with just these cards here. Uh, this, this, that should kill Sario. Oh my god! How did Ludo almost do as much as Slader? What? 180 with a crit versus 240 without a crit. Ah, uh, that seemed a bit weird to me. That did seem a little bit fishy, but oh my god, Death Pierce merges ultimate. All right, we have to go for Death Pierce here. If Death Pierce hits that ultimate, it's not going to be fun. It's definitely not going to be fun. But Death Pierce is just so naturally squishy that we're not going to have an issue taking him out. Um. Uh, I think my Slade is dead here. Uh, oh yeah, he's dead. 67.9, fair play, Death Pierce. Alright. Um, boom, this will kill Death Pierce. Uh, we should be safe against the Gotho. Oh wow, we just killed the Death Pierce flat out. Okay, very good, very good. And then, uh, yeah, at this point, it is GG for that Gotha. We can move on to the next game. Next up, we're going to get Dian Sario. All right, this one's going to be a little bit tricky. It's going to be a little bit tricky. Um, I know he's going to have the dodge food. I just know he's going to have the dodge food. Let's do this. Yeah, this one's going to be a bit tricky. There's your dodge food. Guessed it. Break shield. Nice little hit on Sariel. Um, hmm. What can I do here? Even though Slade is blue, Sariel is still going to destroy him. Oh wow, he is cocky AF. Okay. Alright bro, I'll see you. Maybe we can't kill Sario. Maybe, maybe we can't. This is our best chance to. If we can kill Sario though. Oh my god, 31. 40. Alright, we kill Sorry. Okay, very good. Now, this this should be fine. Maybe, maybe not. We don't have gauge control anymore. How comes Death Pierce? Yeah, we are. Yeah, we're, I, think we're, I think we lose. Oh my god, he gets Dian ultimate. Yeah, we lose this. <laughs> Unfortunate, man. Double blue on this team isn't too great um, and he has the gauge control and I don't so like I can't get ultimates wow Slater didn't crit oh, that is pain that is actual pain yeah I think I'm just gonna scoop Is he going to rush go for ultimate? If he gets go for ultimate, I just scoop because I can't beat this. No gauge control, double blue, he's mono green. I think we just scoop anyway. Yeah, there, there's no point. No point dragging this one out. We're get, we was going to lose anyway. Feels bad, man. Uh, not the greatest matchup, but still. 
Snade was okay. Uh, let's go to the next one. Next up, we get the same guy, man. <clears throat> we really get the same guy, huh? Alright, well, I'm going to rank up Slater this time. Do this. Do this. Yeah, he might be cocky and do the same thing again. Because it worked out really well for him because he, he was able to kill my Gotha. Uh, Alright, he's going to do the same thing again. I'm going to kill his Dian. I'm going to kill his Dian. Oh, I needed that rank up, man. Alright. Oh my god, we merged into another level 3. You what, mate? Am I wrong for thinking these two will be enough for Dian? Surely I can't be wrong. Surely that's going to be enough, man. Dian's defense stat... Oh my god, it's not going to be enough. And Slater just decides to not crit. Oh my goodness. However, we do have his ultimate now. So the opponent is in a bit of a bad spot, but we have adapted. After watch it, after seeing the first game, we have adapted to make uh, different plays. Sorry, old life steals a bunch. I don't think we can kill him. Yeah, I guess we lose again. Unless unless Ludo kills her with these two AoEs, we, we lose once again. Oh my god, he's going to do it. Uh, get rid <laughs> All right, we made uh, we made the correct adjustments and we reap the rewards as we win the the uh, the second game. So yeah, clearly what my opponent was thinking is that he will kill uh, he will kill my Gotha. And then at that point, even uh, even after we kill Sario, he's going to have a mono green team and we're going to have double blue. So he's like very confident he'd win that matchup, which let's be fair, he will win that matchup. But we got incredibly lucky uh, with our RNG in regards to Slater. But generally, like our chance to beat this specific team is not good. And wow, even then he gets Gotha ultimate. We, we, we're we going to lose again. We're going to lose again. Ah. I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. We're going to lose again. This guy has our number, boys. We can't beat this man. This dude has our number. Oh, my goodness. Just as I was saying, we are going to win the... Oh, my God. I didn't even see how much gauges Gotha had, man. Yeah. Uh, very well played for my opponent. Clearly, uh, this guy does have, uh, does have some pretty good knowledge. It's not even like he outplays us. In the first game, he did outplay us. But in the second one, it's like, I'm expecting things. But I just can't stop the ult rush because he kills my Gotha. And, uh, you know, with Death Pierce, he's just going to destroy uh, my units. So, unfortunate. We lost quite a few games in this video. But, let's be real. Slater kind of sucks. <laughs> Slater kind of sucks. He's definitely not the not the greatest unit in the world. I mean, he's, he's okay. But it's like... It's definitely uh, a little bit underwhelming, a little bit underwhelming, uh, even trying to give him as much support as possible. But then again, it's not his fault. You know, he is a day one SSR unit, very, very old character. Uh, but yeah, I don't know who else I want to test, but uh, in terms of my dude Slater, that will be it for this one, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed watching me lose quite a few games uh, using Slater, but it was pretty fun. Uh, testing out like I said a very old unit if you did enjoy today's video leave a like subscribe to my channel if you are new turn on that notification bell and I'll catch you guys later on today with another video